I actually studied fine art and set design at UCLA. So for me, coming to Pratt was kind of a no-brainer because this is a fine art institute. But uh, not only that, they, they also have um, the Sustainable Environmental Systems Program, which is housed in the School of Architecture. So for me, I knew that was going to be a way to sort of integrate my creative practice with this new field of sustainability that I was interested in pursuing. The SES program, the biggest draw was probably, well, a couple things. Uh, the nighttime class schedule because I knew that would allow me to find jobs or internships or whatever else I wanted to do during the day in New York while I'm here. Um, and also the fact that our professors are working practitioners in the field. Um, so we get a really good balance of practical skills and application and knowledge uh, as well as a good like strong academic foundation um, from the people who know it and do it firsthand. I really enjoyed my green infrastructure design and build studio. Um, it really allowed me to develop a lot of my creative work and my portfolio. Uh, our site was the Red Hook NYCHA houses um, and we designed uh, an open space water, stormwater management intervention for that area. Over spring break I went to Rio de Janeiro with my participatory planning class. Um, we were looking at the favela communities in Rio de Janeiro and we were talking to community members about how they uh, have to sort of provide their own infrastructure there, their own waste management, their own sewerage. We got to give a presentation at Studio X, Columbia Studio X in Rio, and several of the favela community members were there. Um, my presentation was about solid waste management in the favelas and um, I felt like it was very well received and it was a really great opportunity to start a dialogue with um, the, the people of Rio de Janeiro. When I first started here, I was a graduate assistant in the office and I've continued to do that pretty much throughout my time here. Um, and I think that's a really good way of staying in touch with professors and being involved with whatever academic initiatives they're working on and also um, working with your classmates in a professional context, working together collaboratively. In addition to that, I was also an intern at the Metropolitan Waterfront Alliance, which is a nonprofit organization that advocates for more sustainable use and access to the waterfront in New York City. Um, and when I worked there, I actually was able to also use a lot of my design skills and some of my outreach skills to uh, work with a lot of different environmental organizations around New York City to put together an environmental education curriculum. I currently work at the Department of Environmental Protection. I am a college aide. It's been a really unique experience working for a city agency. Before I was working on in, in the nonprofit sector, so now working on the city government side and seeing both sides of that role has been enlightening for me. Well, I think definitely being at Pratt, as I said, like a lot of our instructors are working practitioners in the field. So it has been immensely helpful to me um, having connections in different places all over the city, people I can reach out to when I'm interested in applying for a job or when I'm interested in attending an event. Um, it's just nice to know I've, I've crossed paths with so many people at this point. I, I feel like I have a really great network in the sustainability field here.